Howdy everyone, Poacher here with an Agent Magic video and in today's video we're moving into the ninth round of the AI Championships. In this round we have built an AOE team for the Challengers 2 verse, so we're going to see how they go. The scores, the current scores are up on the screen and we'll have the updated scores at the end, so let's get into it and get the fights going. Up first we have Desiree, so let's see how they go. Big AOE from Grotto there, bit of a freeze but that's fine. Gerda, uh, Freyhel comes out with some AOE, then the Gerda. It's not doing too much. They're hanging in there. A bit of a heal from the Halus. The Librarian just never starts with his AoE, which is really, really good for AI fights. The Absorbs are kicking in, getting some good Absorbs there, especially from the uh, or the Black Mark, whatever it's called. I forget. The Scar... Uh, Scara, is it Jarred? That's perfect. Only the Gerda left, and it should be a pretty safe win. The Gerda is an Awakened, so she's not applying the slowdown at the beginning of the fight. Overall, Gerda is quite weak. I think she's the weakest of the Van Norse. It's really the Awakening on her passive that makes her a weapon. And there we go. Desiree gets five points, making it through to the next round. Let's move on to the next clan. Jumping into battle, we have Dragons Reborn. Let's see how they go. They are at the top, I believe, or second at the moment. So this is a fight I think they needed to take. It's a, it's a scary fight, but I think overall the team is pretty pretty decent to verse. I don't think it's the worst team we've seen. Definitely a contender for for some points, some potential points. I've thrown some ba pretty bad ones in there, trying to trick people. I think this one overall was all right. I think the Gerda was the scariest one on the team. I did put her at seven Arcane Stars, but... Not many people really care too much about that. I think they realize that overall she's not really that much of a threat. It's when she's awakened that she does become a threat. And as you can see, uh, Dragon Reborn have easily come through with this team. And they're going to score themselves a nice little five points. Well done. Moving on to the next clan. Up next, we have Echo. Let's see how they go. The AoE comes out from the Omphus. We're going to have to wait for the big hit from the... Uh, Roxanne is going to reset some initiative there. The defense comes out from the ram. Here comes the initiative reset. Good. Nearly kills the librarian. The uh, AoE comes out. Their, ta their team is pretty tanky. Hopefully this AoE does jar. It just jars the Scara. The librarian really needs to be taken out here. He could potentially do a lot of damage. A Siegfried is taken out. I think librarian is going to get... Oh, yeah, he, go. he takes out the Omphus. Quite scary. The ram does die. The 2v two at the moment but uh, they're safe i think they're safe the ever still has the resurrect which is huge that's gonna pretty much get them the win here as the ever comes through gets the execute still the girder left she's doing a little bit of damage there on the ever but i don't think it's gonna matter all too much she can take out the ever it's probably the best character to take out she comes back to life does not bring the ramfit back interesting was there a, an anti-res i'm not too sure if there was or not maybe there was either way Either way, there we go. Nice five points to Echo. Up next, we have Second Sanctuary. Let's see how they go. They have a nice little Van North team. Should get a bit of magic absorb out. The Freyhel initial damage is actually quite a lot. Probably could have made her a bit stronger, make the team a bit more scarier. Gerda AoE comes in. Oh, actually a lot of damage here. They've got the um, Ice Mark up as well. So it could potentially be a little... Ah, oh, never mind. Here comes the Shields. Here come the Shields to save the day. <coughs> Oh, it was scary for a second there. And the Raymond and the Grotto combo just pop off. Full shields. Crazy stuff. That is insane. The Librarian was there to actually counter shields. But because the AI uses his Black Mirror first, it's... Yeah, unfortunately, just not enough. Not enough. So, Second Sanctuary get themselves another five points. Well done. Up next, we have the Russians. So, let's see how they... Go. Now the Russians, not the Russians, sorry, the guards, the goos, do not have the privilege, the benefit of the magic absorb. So we'll see if that makes any difference. They do have segment, they do have jars. So I think they should be okay. But as you can see, they don't have that safety net of the barrier provided by the magic absorb. AoE comes out. No canopic jars have been uh, created yet. Oh, there we go. Impus was in one, maybe, but he came back. He's fine. And then out comes the Gerda. A nice, safe win for them. Five points to the Russians. Back in last fight is Witchblade. Let's see how they go. Siri oh, just absolutely takes out Siegfried. 
There's still the AoE left though, so we'll see how that goes. The AoE from the Gerda comes out. But remember, every time a shield is hit, the Siri is going to counter-attack as well. That is the benefit. Oh, AI Librarian is just such a disappointment. He does get his um, stacks to trigger though. Kind of gets a bit of damage out, but it's not really going to make any difference. It's a nice, easy five points for Witchblade, and we have one battle left. Final battle, we have Warrior Union. Again, same team as Witchblade, just one Arcane Star difference in their two of their characters. They come through, they take out the Siegfried as well. The results should pretty much be the exact same. It'd be interesting to see a team trying to create a team where both of these teams say yes and no to the fight. They're just not sure of the outcome. But that's what we're going to have to do for the last one, I think. We're going to have to really create a team that makes everyone question whether or not they want to fight it. They come through, the three characters left. The Scar is capable of doing a fair bit of damage. Out comes the AoE. Ooh, outcome of this battle might, might be different. Three characters are very close to being jarred. Gerda comes through, she jars the, the Siri. Siri does come back, though. <laughs> it was a lot closer than the Witchblade fight. There we go. There is five points for Warrior Union as well. And we'll go look at the Teleport. There we have it, ladies and gents, the final score for round nine. We have one round left, and then that is going to complete season five of the AI Championship. So we'll see you soon with the final test. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to comment below. I will answer it to the best of my ability. And we're around the world. Until next time, please take care of yourself.